Assalam o Alaikum students welcome to my channel students in this video article I am going to discuss about the anatomy of the papilla of the duodenum which are present in the second part of the duodenum I will tell you some important features of these papilla of the duodenum papilla of the duodenum in the interior of the duodenum there is thick mucous membrane in the first part of the duodenum it is smooth while in the rest of the duodenum it shows special features that are prominent mostly in the second part of the duodenum it shows numerous circular folds which are called the plaque circularis the minor duodenal papilla and the major duodenal papilla at the site where the accessory pancreatic duct opens into the duodenum it is called the minor duodenal papilla it is about 1.9 cm and present 6 to 8 cm distal to the pylorus end of the stomach. It has importance in the embryology. Embryologically, the accessory pancreatic duct is the main drainage duct of the dorsal pancreatic but in the embryo. On the other hand, major duodenal papilla, it is also called the papilla of the water. Major duodenal papilla is a small rounded elevation present posterior medially where the bile duct and the main pancreatic duct open into the duodenum. It is almost 8 to 10 cm distal to the pylorus. Major duodenal papilla is the primary mechanism for the secretion of the bile and the other enzymes that facilitate in the digestion process. At the junction of the bile and the pancreatic duct, there is a sphincter of the OD. The sphincter of the OD, which is present at the junction of the bile and the pancreatic duct. The sphincter of OD controls the flow of the bile and, and the pancreatic juice into the duodenum and prevents reflex of the duodenal contents into the bile and the pancreatic duct. So the these are the some special features of the papilla of the duodenum. Thank you very much.